Hi guys, how is everyone? I feel like it's been such a long time since I put up a video. So I just want to show you guys a couple of things that I've picked up over the past couple of weeks. And let's just get into the video. So first thing I have here are some covers that I picked up from Erin Condren. She was having a sale. They were buy one, get one free. So I picked up this green and gold one. I thought the color was really pretty and appropriate for March. So as you can see on the front, it just says Lucky Me in Gold. And then on the bottom, instead of putting my name, I decided to put my blog, Stephanie's Style. Because I have so many of these with just my name on it, so I decided to do something a little different. And this is how the inside of it looks. It's just a lighter green. And here is the back. Love it. So let me show you the other cover that I picked, I picked up. this one up and this is more of a teal kind of color and the flowers in the background are white and kind of crocheted looking. I thought that was a really nice look. And then I also put my website on the bottom, stephaniesastyle.com. And this is how the inside of it looks and this is the back cover. So whenever Erin Condren has a sale, I suggest you jump right on it because these covers, like I said, were buy one, get one free. Next, I picked up some stickers from these Etsy shops that I never tried before. So I'll go through those and show you what I picked up. And of course, everything was on sale. You know me, I love a discount. So these two sets are from Seven Designs Co. I've never purchased anything from this Etsy shop before. Picked up a little sampler set. And these just have roses on them. There's some full boxes, some heart check boxes, and some half boxes along the side right here. And then you have your pay day, your bill due, your to-do list. And then you have your little icons over here. So you can do a nice little spread with these. I like these half sheets because you can combine these with other stickers that you have. So you don't necessarily need to buy a full sheet to do a spread. And then I picked these up. I thought these were so pretty and floral and feminine. You have your roses and then you have your little square boxes right here. You have your weekend banner, your heart check box, and you have your rose ones and your hearts. And obviously I got this to use for Valentine's Day. I did use a spread. I did do a spread for Valentine's Day, but I just didn't use this. I figure I can save this for next year. Same one, Seven Designs Co. And here's the little free sheet that came with it. So you again, you have your check boxes, your full box, your check boxes, some hearts, and a weekend These banner. Pastel. I guess you can say green and peach kind of colors and you have the gold ones right here. You have some full boxes, some half boxes, heart check boxes, your icons, a weekend banner. So you can use this to do a whole spray, which I really loved. I love the colors on these. And then I got some more stickers of just every of um, grocery store stickers. Since, you know, who doesn't go grocery shopping all the time? So I figured stock up on these. These are cute. And these are all in all different rainbow colors. And then I picked up these flags. Full boxes with the check heart checklist inside the box. And then I have these payday dollar sign stickers and day off stickers. So I tried to get a lot of functional stickers. I got three sheets from this Etsy shop and the name of this shop is Fia Sticks. Fia Sticks? It's P-H-I-A Sticks. Sorry girl if I'm mispronouncing I had it. some stickers that I absolutely had to grab up and I got these coffee full box stickers. And you know, it says, but first coffee, less Monday, more coffee. Who doesn't love coffee? Especially me. I love Starbucks. 
and I got these book ones because y'all know I love me a book and this one says keep calm and read a book it says I like big books and I cannot lie mm -hmm. this one says drink coffee read books be happy so I cannot wait to use these in a spread and these are just some other stickers that I got that are all quotes focus on the good And there's another quote in here by Maya Angelou. So I can't wait to use these in a spread also. Next I have this bag of goodies from Michaels. So let's go ahead and get I it. I saw this cookbook from the Neelys. Now I know y'all remember the Neelys. They're this married couple. They had a show on the Food Network a couple years ago. Patrick and Gina Neely. And this is Down Home with the Neelys, a Southern Family Cookbook. So I picked this up because this is on clearance. And I remember watching them on the Food Network and I used to love them. Good recipes in here that I wanted to try. Like white bean, soup with kale, spinach salad with bacon, blue cheese, pecans and cranberries. So this book really caught my eye. So I decided to pick this up. Cookbook from the Neelys. From Michaels, I also got washi tape. So I got this cute floral and checkered one with polka dot and then I got this floral one a polka dot one and this floral one with the brown checker this is more this is fabric tape this is thicker than washi tape and it has a rougher not rough but it's fabric tape so it's a little bit more sturdy than washi tape and it's a lot easier to peel off. If you cut a piece, put it down and want to put it back up, it's easier. And then I also got this crafted paper. This was on sale. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do with this. I figured I might line the inside of my vanity drawer or maybe cover some books that I want to display out. But don't really care about the books anymore. And maybe just cover that with the fabric tape. So we'll see. And then I also got this mug from Betsy Johnson. And it has pink lip kisses on it. And on the inside it has a pink lip right here. And it says XO Betsy. And even the side, the handle is shaped like a heart. Can you see? How cute is that? And of course all of this was on sale. Last but not least, I got this favorites this is actually a recipe I think home. I'm gonna use this to put my makeup samples in and not use it as a recipe holder because I have a recipe book already so I keep this displayed on my vanity look how cute and it says favorite on here So the last item that I picked up, y'all, was this yellowtail sangria. I just love me some sangria. I've never tried yellowtail before. This is not one of my favorites. I did cut up a golden delicious apple and sliced the apple up and stuck it in the bottle because it was a little bitter. So I do, honestly, I like the cheaper ones and the glass jugs better than the more expensive ones so just grab me some yellowtail so guys thank you so much for watching and make sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below bye